Children who come into a critical care unit when they're very sick are almost always given some fluids. It's a tricky balance about how much fluid to give children. That changes on an hourly basis because their sickness is also changing. I want to learn how to do things better for the children we look after on the critical care unit. One of the areas I'm quite interested in is uh, use of artificial intelligence and software to try and help make decisions because some of the decisions we make are very complex. This grant award is really important for us because we want to develop a software system that helps doctors and nurses to know how best to manage fluid therapy in critically ill children. Without this grant, it'd be much more difficult to do this research because we need a dedicated, trained data scientist to be able to do this work in order to look at the vast amount of data we're going to be looking at and to develop the computer software models. So this is really key for us. What excites me about this research project is that we are working closely with the adult critical care team and building new collaborations so that we can learn from each other. The BMA Foundation grants are very important for researchers who are just starting off so that they can develop the idea, get some data and establish some of these findings before they then get further larger funding. They say persistence is the key quality for research and there are always ups and downs but the effort pays off uh, and I remember that every time I come into work even when I have down days I think the end result is worth it.